Welcome to Ed Foodie. Today we're going to make a tortellini soup, which really sounds uh, really delicious. It's going to have lots of dill in it, uh, some spinach. It's going to be healthy. And uh, the, the soup base, it's a chicken broth, but I think by the time we're done with this, it's going to taste something like a hollandaise sauce because we got egg yolks and, I mean, we got eggs and we got some lemon juice to put in there. So it um, sounds really, really good, creamy, smooth with some tortellini. So the first thing we want to do, I've got eight cups of water and into the water, and it's on a medium, medium high heat. The first thing I want to do is I've got some of this, it's, it's a bouillon paste. Um, and actually I had a little bit of trouble finding this. This is called better than bouillon. And uh, what it says on the lid is one teaspoon equals one cube of bouillon. What we're going to do here is put in um, a tablespoon plus one teaspoon. Okay, we're going to whisk this in till the paste is dissolved. So we're going to bring this to a, a boil, then we'll add our tortellini. All right, my soup base is almost to a boil. So we're going to add the tortellini. What I'm using here is I got a 24 ounce package of um, ricotta and spinach tortellini. I want to use about half of it, so you want to use about 10 or 12 ounces of, and I'm using the refrigerated tortellini. Uh, I'm going to cook it according to instructions, which is three to four minutes. So we'll add our tortellini. All right, and we'll cook that for about, like I said, three to four minutes, whatever your package says. Okay, our four minutes is done, and what I'm gonna do is um, scoop out, and use the slotted spoon to uh, take out the tortellini. And what I'm gonna do is put it right into the serving soup bowls. I'm only making two bowls. This should serve about three or four I'm going to turn it off, put a lid on this because we're going to, we want this pretty warm. What I've got here is four eggs. I want to whisk these, get these eggs nice and scrambled smooth. I think this would also work better if you used, if you let the eggs sit out get a room temperature because the temperature of these really makes a difference when you pour it back into the soup. We'll go ahead and add a teaspoon of fresh ground pepper. Let's add a quarter cup of fresh lemon juice. And for me that was about a one and a half lemons. So now for the tricky part. If, if I would just dump this into the hot liquid right now it would kind of end up looking like egg drop soup. And that's not what we're looking for today. We want to have a nice creamy soup. So what I'm going to do is take about a cup of the warm chicken broth. And we'll slowly pour this in and keep stirring as you do it. It's important to keep that stirring so those eggs don't turn into scrambled eggs. Back to our broth. I've turned the heat back on to keep it at a low simmer. I'm going to slowly pour this egg mixture as I keep stirring the chicken broth. We're going to let this go on a simmer until this thickens up a little bit. I'm going to taste this just to make sure there's enough salt. 
So here's where you could add salt if you needed to, or if it was too salty, you'd add maybe another half a cup of water. I'm going to add just a little bit more pepper. I guess it thickened up a little bit. I'm just gonna stir in this pepper. Got a, a nine ounce package of spinach. And what I've done was kind of picked off all the, the long, the hard stems. So all we have is the leaves. We're gonna pour this in and this will soften up real quick. Yeah, looks great. Then the last, what I'm gonna really love, I got about a half a cup of fresh chopped dill. And that sounds like a lot of dill, but oh, I bet this is gonna taste good. And the half a cup, what I, what I bought was a two thirds ounce uh, fresh dill. I saved back a couple little pinches that we're gonna just pinch on top of the bowls. We're gonna ladle this onto our bowls. And the last little topping I want to do is uh, just drizzle a very little bit of sesame oil. That'll just give it a little bit of a nice little nutty taste. So there we have it. Looks great. Catherine's going to try the tortellini soup. Oh, by the way, I did sprinkle the, the dill on top, the little bit of dill that was left. What do you call these? Tortellini soup. Mmm. Right? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. Well, I like that dill. That's really good. Mm. If you like this video, tortellini soup, please subscribe to Ed Foodie. Give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe over there. Thank you so much for watching.